Hi Aquarius, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your weekly reading for January 8th through January 14th. This is for the sign of Aquarius. I have pre-shuffled this deck so I'm only going to shuffle it for a moment. Please keep in mind that this is not a private reading. Take what resonates and leave the rest. I will be doing a love reading next. focus this in in just a moment. Okay, so we have some completions here. We have some good luck coming in. Good fortune, perhaps. Some kind of truth as well. It looks like you guys are being given some kind of gift this week. It's a gift of truth. Some kind of power. Power or truth. Maybe it's a truth that brings about, gives you some kind of power. There's definite, it definitely looks really good. It's like you are getting, uh, it's like a period time of liberation, okay? Um, it looks really good so far. Um, you're releasing some something heavy, some burden is being released via this truth that you're getting, okay? A burden is being released and I think it's something you've been manifesting or something that you've been waiting for. It's like all of a sudden, some kind of action, some some kind of um, willingness that you have taken on to let go of something is bringing you in a gift, some kind of gift. Make sure this is focused in correctly. Um, You're letting go of some kind of responsibility. Some responsibility is being lifted. It's weird. Or some kind of burden. Maybe there's something that comes out, some kind of truth that you are waiting. Maybe there is, there's, it's like a relief. Something's come out and, and now you can let that go. You know, there's some kind of relief here. It feels like there's... There's a lot of power. You're you're in control this week. You are in control of something. It is. It's a week of liberation. It's a week of uh, contentment. Um, it's like things are shaping up very very nicely. You're you're moving right along. You're headed in the right direction. And I believe that there's good luck. Something very good is coming. There's a change of course that happens suddenly. It's like a sudden change of course. But it's something that you have created. You've created this change. And it brings about some kind of balance to your life. You know, something is leaving your life that needs to leave, that you've been waiting for, that you've been just waiting for it to go away, and it's gone. And I see, like, a huge relief here. All right? Um, and it's like... Whatever this was, it's it's like there was some kind of trouble in your life that was causing you trouble, and it's gone. All of a sudden, the trouble is gone, and it's because of the way that you handled it. You handle something with, with tact and grace, and it's like these challenges, this trouble, this conflict just dissolves because of how you handle it. It looks like you're handling something... Um, that was a burden, that was heavy, you're handling it so well that it just dissolves, okay? Um, and, it, and it's pretty amazing because it, you probably thought that it, that it was going to be a disaster, but it works itself out. It's like a victory here. It's, it is. I feel like there's a victory here. Success. There's success in something that you've been waiting for, all right? Let's see what this is. <laughs> what is this? What are they letting go of? Somebody that betrayed you, perhaps, or some kind of betrayal. 
you're letting go of something, some kind of uh, deceit. It feels like maybe it's from another person. Maybe there was a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio that deceived you. And either you're just letting that, that feeling go, you're letting the, you're forgiving, you know, that kind of thing. Or you are just totally, it's just like totally not even affecting you this week. You're just, your strength, your confidence, your discipline, your ability to master your emotion just dissolves the whole situation. It's like there was some kind of sneaky shit going on. You find out about it and you handle it. And it's it's a relief because you knew the sneaky shit was going on. And this could be at work, could be at home, could be in love, whatever. It's like there was some sneaky shit that was going on that you that comes to light. And you handle it so well that it is a uh, day or week of liberation, okay? It's like the worst is over. Great. Congratulations, you know. Now we don't have to worry about this anymore. Perhaps the destructive end that you thought was going to happen <clears throat> turns out to be not the destructive end. You know what I mean? <coughs> I apologize. I'm, I'm still, I still have a cold. What? I want to clarify a little bit more. I want to know, I want to know what this uh, Ten of Swords is. It's like somebody was taking from you. Somebody was taking something from you or you were, they were using you. They were taking advantage of you. And this could have been at, at the workplace or, or something. It looks like somebody was taking advantage of you. And now the truth comes out that you were being taken advantage of. And it's like everybody knows it. And that's where your liberation comes from. It's like, ha ha. Ha ha. It wasn't me, was it? That kind of thing. I think whatever this was, you know, somebody was trying to blame you or take advantage of you for something. I think it comes to light and it gets shown that it wasn't you. And, and once it comes out, it's like a huge relief. You're in control. You're in control. And you're handling this situation very well. Your oracle card is release and surrender. We shower you with blessings of our radiant love. Open your arms and release the challenges that you've held tightly gripped within your hands. Open your hands, arms, and heart to our love and assistance. Something is being released. And it's working out in your favor. Okay? Something is coming to light that works out in your favor and you handle it very, very well. Okay, something is you thought was going to be destructive, you thought was going to cause an uproar, actually doesn't. I see a change of course where it, it really brings you something good in the end. Okay, it's like somebody was taking advantage of you and it comes to light that it wasn't you, it was them. And that's what I see. Stay tuned for your love reading.